The Minute 90 legends are so pleasing, are so gaining points. So welcome once again at Al Ahli Online TV English News. I'm Yumna Atwa at Al Ahli Wiya Salam Stadium to get you the top weekly news of the club of the century. So let's start with the headlines. Ajay's race gifts Al Ahli three precious points. Musimani, it's an important victory. Komsan, it's an important win to regain confidence. Al Ali women's basketball team wins Egyptian Cup. Al Ali Fahin Kahraba. In a thrilling game, Al Ahli managed to defeat Tala Agais 2 to 1 in the Egyptian Premier League at Al Ahli Stadium. Tala Agais took the lead in the 27th minute as Ahmed Samir scored the opener from a free kick. The Red Eagle responded quickly in the 32 minute as our winger Junior Adaye scored the equalizer from an impressive header. Adaye was once again the man of the goals as he scored the winner from a brilliant follow up in the 91 minute. After the victory, Al Ahli currently have 24 points, while Tala Agais have 12 points. Our head coach Betsy Musumane said that Al Ahli achieved what we wanted from the match after securing the three points against a tough opponent who was able to create different scoring chances. He stated that it was a difficult match and it became more difficult after losing the last match to Simba. He praised Dishinao's efforts and Ajaye, who scored two goals though he just returned from an injury. Al Ahli's assistant coach Sami Qomsan expressed his happiness after the precious victory over Talaia Gate in the Egyptian Premier League. Qomsan said that the team needed to win the three points to regain confidence ahead of our upcoming match against AS Vita Club in the KEF Champions League group stage. He stated that they faced a strong team with a solid defense. And he assured that the game against AS Vita Club is very important and that they are determined to achieve the victory. Al Ali women's basketball team clinched the Egyptian Cup title after defeating Alexandria Sporting Club 82 to 80 on Saturday. The Red Eagles put on a strong performance in the game at 6 October Sports Hall. Our players dominated the game since its beginning, thanks to the solid defense and the quick attacks. Our basketball ladies won the first set 17 to 16, while Alexandria Sporting Club won the second set 32 to 36. They managed to win the third set 54 to 51, while they were held to a 72-72 draw against the Alexandrian team in the fourth set and managed to secure the title. Al Ali started the current season with an impressive victory after winning the Super Cup in the final game against Heliopolis. Al Ahli's coaching staff decided to impose a fine of 200,000 Egyptian pounds on the team's player Mohamed Garaba and rule him out of matches for one month for disciplinary reasons. Thanks for watching Al Ahli Online TV English News from Al Ahli Wiya Salam Stadium. I'm Yumna Atwa. See you next week.